On Your Side forecast. And the official beginning of autumn is still more than 48 hours away, but very autumn-like weather for the last couple of days. Lots of showers and cooling temperatures, and we still do have some showers uh, mostly to our east now and out of our viewing area, moving down from Fairfield toward the Magic Valley. If you're in the Magic Valley watching on KSA, you may be seeing a few rain showers come in this evening, but generally things clearing out. A few scattered showers still over the foothills here that you can see, and in eastern Oregon we're seeing a few scattered showers as well. Uh, but generally Generally, skies are clearing out. As you watch this loop, you'll notice that towards the end, we start seeing some clearing over the valley. And if you stepped outside over the last hour or so, you've noticed some sunshine hanging out. But our temperature is staying well below average today. 68 are high so far today, and that might be it. 73 this afternoon in Ontario, where the skies cleared out just a little earlier. And skies will continue to clear. And that means getting a little bit chilly at the football game. At 7 o'clock, still 65 degrees. By 9 p.m., 60 degrees and as you leave the game this evening pretty chilly 56 degrees under mostly clear skies so pack a jacket if you're headed to the game tomorrow a bit warmer than today you notice that 8 a.m we're pretty chilly though in the mid 40s 10 o'clock 52 degrees we're still not in the 60s by noon but temperatures will warm more quickly tomorrow than today because of the sunshine and because we'll start to get a more southwesterly flow as a ridge of high pressure slowly moves in our direction so the 10 day trend showing cooler than average today cooler than average tomorrow but then on sunday with a high of 77 we're right where we expect to be this time of year temperatures drop off a bit but still nice for monday and tuesday and then another trough moves in and that cools things down for us once again, and we still have that cool air coming out of the north for now. That's why temperatures will be chilly this evening. This big trough slowly shifting to the east. And as it does, we'll see this warmer air start to come into the picture. But that's ahead of the next storm system that's moving in our direction. So again, that warming won't last all that long, but it will be well timed just in time for the weekend. Sunday looking to be a great day again with those afternoon highs hitting the mid to upper 70s. In the meantime, tomorrow will be warmer than today, but still cooler than average. 69, 70 degrees for our forecast highs tomorrow. I think most places in the Treasure Valley will just hit the low 70s. Not as much wind as today either. Those winds will diminish this evening and then tomorrow out of the west at 5 to 10 miles per hour. Partly cloudy and yeah, I'd call it chilly in the mountains with morning lows getting down into the mid 30s and afternoon highs only into the low 60s in Stanley 20 eight for a morning low. That's chilly. 59 for the afternoon high. Could see an isolated shower here and there. And in the Magic Valley, mostly sunny skies. Winds out of the west, but only at 5 to 15 miles per hour. Still a bit cool with those afternoon highs only making the mid 60s. There you see 69 for Boise tomorrow. 77 on Sunday is exactly where we should be this time of year. Autumn begins on Monday and autumn will be in the air as it has been for the last couple of days and then temperatures really cooling as we head toward next weekend. I like this weekend. Ah, it's nice. Me too. Good temperatures. All right. Thanks, Steve. You bet. Well, coming up on six on your side, grass, sagebrush.